your tyre related needs and a fantastic service, call or drop into Phillips Tyres in Oxford. So we've got, welcome back again to the shooting channel for another one of our Browning, new Browning launches. This is the new Browning laminate, but the game laminate. So we all know how the, the laminate went and very successful. Me personally, the old laminate, it's a great gun. It's just not traditional, but this is where Browning are really scoring in the industry at the moment is they're doing things different and that is what the industry needs it needs change the coronavirus is one thing that's really taught us that the shooting world needs to come out of itself look at all these youtube channels this one look at johnny's how it's grown the industry and this is where we need more manufacturers to come in and support doing different things and I think Browning has to have a tick in a box. They've got the MK11, they've got this, they've got lots of things they've done different. So this one is the new Browning game laminate. Comes with its multi-chokes. Comes with its chokes, obviously two in the gun, three there, so it comes with four multi ch uh, chokes. Comes with trigger lock, and then this is the gun. That is the new laminate game look. Again, they've made it nice and smooth. Again, it's got its recoil pad. Browning are very, very good at re reducing these recoil pads and reducing the recoil for the shooter. So if you press that there, how soft that is. So they've got the adjustable trigger there. So they've kept, if you remember how the clay one is, they've kept the look the same. They've just changed that to slightly more wooden look. So it looks a little bit more gamey. Again, they've got more of the the traditional game forend on it. Not ventilated ribs, they've got matte black barrels. So the glare when you're shooting, there's no glare that comes off the barrels. Game rib. Again, they've been clever and they've made it with a bit of height in the comb. So it's got that height in that comb there. So when you mount the gun, again, the gun eye comes over that rib so it will fit a lot of people. This is a gun, again, I, I quite like it. I like to be more slightly traditional. I do like the MK11 that I've, I've previously done. If you're looking for something a little bit different, this is the gun. They've now got the Sporter, they've now got the game gun. And this is the gun, and it worked. It worked on the Sporters. They've got loads out there. So this is something, a little bit different. So if you want something a little bit different, you don't want to be the same old, same old, which is what most shooters do. Come and have a look at one of these. It is a fantastic piece of piece of work. It is a fantastic gun. And it's just pushing that boundary. It's pushing that box. It's going outside the box and it's thinking outside. Let's see what it shoots like. Just press one, one first, one then one, A, A then B. And I have got some 24 grams, so nice little light for Yockeys that I'm using today. Pull. 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 
pull. It is a little bit lighter than the clay one, but obviously that's because it's a game gun. And that it's, it's, but it's not too light. It's not stupidly light. So it actually is a nice little game. I actually prefer this one than I do the clay gun. The clay gun is real heavy. So I actually think they've got this about right. They've got this right for almost beginners to start to shoot clays with. Um, so I actually think they've actually gone, done, first shooting the first one, I wasn't that keen. Shooting this laminate, I have to say, it's put it up in my, up in my list. Um, and I think this laminate comes up better than the original one. I don't think laminate's gonna take over from wood. I think it will have a place as well as wood because people are out there, they do want that traditional look. But I think this will, the new generation of shooters coming into shooting, they want something different. So I don't think it will take over, but I think it will be a big part in the shooting world, this laminate look. So again, it's another tick in the box for Browning thinking outside the box and doing different things rather than just producing the same old gun time and time again. So I think, I think that is a well good all round gun. And even if you're not in the game shooting, I think this will, this will work for people coming into clay shooting as well. It has got the 525 action. So it's not the 725 action, it's the 525 action. Um, so it's built on the original 525 action, which is the, the one that everyone knows, the one that everyone loves anyway. So give it a go, come and have a look, see what you think. Please share to your friends and have a look at what other films we've done. And it's all there to try and encourage you to get into shooting this great sport.